Today, we're diving into a topic that is often overlooked but holds immense importance, the red flags we shouldn't ignore within ourselves. We often focus on identifying warning signs in others, but it's equally essential to examine our own behaviors, thoughts, and emotions. In this video, we'll explore six red flags that you should pay attention to in yourself and discuss why addressing them is crucial for your personal growth and well-being. Self-awareness is a powerful tool on our journey of self-discovery. It allows us to recognize our strengths, weaknesses, and areas for improvement. By identifying and acknowledging red flags within ourselves, we empower ourselves to make positive changes, break destructive patterns, and cultivate healthier habits. It's important to remember that acknowledging these red flags is not about self-judgment or criticism. Instead, it's an opportunity for self-reflection, understanding, and growth. Recognizing these warning signs is a step towards greater self-awareness and a path to living a more fulfilling and balanced life. So, without further ado, let's dive into the six red flags you shouldn't ignore in yourself. As we explore each red flag, take a moment to reflect on your own experiences and see if any of these resonate with you. Remember, self-awareness is a journey, and it's never too late to make positive changes in your life. Red flag number one, ignoring your emotions. In our fast-paced and often demanding lives, it's easy to brush aside our emotions, deeming them as insignificant or inconvenient. However, by suppressing or neglecting our emotions, we deny ourselves the opportunity for self-awareness, growth, and emotional well-being. Emotions are valuable messengers that provide insights into our needs, desires, and experiences. When we ignore our emotions, they can manifest in harmful ways, such as increased stress, anxiety, or even physical ailments. It's essential to create a safe space for our emotions, allowing ourselves to acknowledge and explore them without judgment. This means practicing self-compassion and embracing the full range of our emotions, even those we may perceive as negative. By developing emotional intelligence and cultivating a healthy relationship with our emotions, we can enhance our self-understanding, improve our communication with others, and nurture deeper, more meaningful connections. Red flag number two, constant self-criticism. While self-reflection and striving for personal growth are important aspects of our journey, constantly criticizing ourselves is a self-destructive habit that can erode our self-esteem and hinder our progress. When we engage in relentless self-criticism, we create a negative feedback loop that perpetuates feelings of inadequacy and self-doubt. It's important to recognize that self-improvement should be driven by self-compassion and self-love. Instead of focusing solely on our perceived flaws and failures, we can shift our attention to acknowledging our strengths, celebrating our achievements, and embracing our unique qualities. By practicing self-acceptance and fostering a positive self-image, we create a solid foundation for personal growth and build resilience to face challenges and setbacks with kindness and resilience. Red flag number three, difficulty setting boundaries. Boundaries are essential for maintaining healthy relationships, protecting our well-being, and fostering self-respect. When we struggle to set and enforce boundaries, we risk compromising our physical, emotional, and mental health. It's crucial to recognize that setting boundaries is not a selfish act but an act of self-preservation and self-care. By clearly defining our limits and communicating them assertively, we create a space that honors our needs, values, and priorities. This involves understanding our personal boundaries, recognizing when they are being crossed or violated, and taking appropriate action to assert ourselves. Setting boundaries also means learning to say no when necessary, prioritizing self-care, and surrounding ourselves with individuals who respect and support our boundaries. By cultivating healthy boundaries, we create healthier relationships, reduce stress, and foster a greater sense of self-worth and empowerment. Red flag number four, neglecting self-care. In the midst of our busy lives, it's all too easy to prioritize the needs of others and neglect our own well-being. However, when we consistently neglect self-care, we undermine our physical, emotional, and mental health. Neglecting self-care can manifest in various ways, such as ignoring the importance of restful sleep, neglecting proper nutrition, skipping regular exercise, or failing to engage in activities that bring us joy and rejuvenation. By neglecting self-care, we deplete our energy reserves, increase our stress levels, and compromise our overall well-being. It's crucial to recognize that self-care is not selfish, but rather an essential practice that enables us to show up as our best selves in all areas of life. By prioritizing self-care activities, such as engaging in hobbies, setting boundaries, practicing relaxation techniques, and seeking support when needed, we can replenish our energy, reduce stress, and cultivate a greater sense of balance and fulfillment in our lives. Neglecting self-care not only affects our physical health but also takes a toll on our emotional and mental well-being. 
When we continuously put others' needs before our own and fail to nurture our emotional and mental health, we become susceptible to emotional exhaustion, burnout, and a decline in our overall quality of life. Neglecting self-care in these areas can manifest as neglecting our emotional needs, avoiding difficult emotions, or failing to prioritize activities that promote our mental well-being. It's essential to acknowledge and validate our emotions, practice self-compassion, and engage in activities that promote emotional well-being, such as journaling, talking to a trusted friend or therapist, or engaging in mindfulness practices. By prioritizing our emotional and mental health, we cultivate greater self-awareness, resilience, and the ability to navigate life's challenges more effectively. Furthermore, neglecting self-care can have long-term consequences on our self-esteem and self-worth. When we consistently put our own needs last and neglect self-care, we send a message to ourselves that we are not deserving of love, care, and attention. This can lead to a decline in our self-esteem and a distorted self-perception. Neglecting self-care can manifest in self-neglecting behaviors, such as neglecting personal grooming, failing to engage in activities that make us feel good about ourselves, or neglecting our personal and professional goals. It's crucial to recognize that self-care is an act of self-love and self-respect. By prioritizing self-care and nurturing our self-esteem, we build a strong foundation of self-worth, confidence, and the belief that we deserve to live a life that aligns with our values and aspirations. Taking the time to invest in our physical, emotional, and mental well-being is not only beneficial for ourselves but also allows us to show up as our best selves for others and contribute positively to our relationships and communities. Red flag number 5, avoiding personal accountability. Taking responsibility for our actions, choices, and the consequences they bring is an essential aspect of personal growth and development. However, when we avoid personal accountability, we deny ourselves the opportunity to learn from our mistakes and grow as individuals. Avoiding personal accountability can manifest in various ways, such as blaming others for our failures, making excuses, or deflecting responsibility onto external factors. It's important to recognize that true growth comes from taking ownership of our actions and learning from them. By embracing personal accountability, we empower ourselves to make positive changes, cultivate resilience, and build stronger relationships based on trust and integrity. It involves reflecting on our behaviors, acknowledging our role in any given situation, making amends when necessary, and actively working towards personal growth and improvement. Red flag number 6, resisting personal growth and change. Change is an inevitable part of life, and our ability to embrace it and grow from it is crucial for personal development. However, when we resist personal growth and change, we limit our potential and hinder our progress. Resisting personal growth can stem from fear of the unknown, a desire to stay within our comfort zones, or a lack of self-belief. It's important to recognize that personal growth requires us to step outside our familiar routines and explore new possibilities. Embracing change opens doors to new opportunities, expanded perspectives, and personal transformation. It involves developing a growth mindset, which includes being open to learning, embracing challenges, and seeking opportunities for self-improvement. By embracing personal growth and change, we unlock our full potential, discover new talents and passions, and create a life that aligns with our true selves. It requires self-reflection, a willingness to let go of limiting beliefs, and a commitment to continuous learning and self-improvement. And there you have it, the six red flags you shouldn't ignore in yourself. Recognizing these warning signs is the first step towards personal growth and self-improvement. Remember, self-awareness is a powerful tool that allows us to take control of our lives and make positive changes. In this video, we explored the red flags of excessive self-criticism, ignoring boundaries, stagnation in comfort zones, neglecting self-care, avoiding personal accountability, and resisting personal growth and change. Each of these red flags can hinder our progress, hinder our relationships, and hinder our overall well-being. But here's the good news, by identifying these red flags, we can take proactive steps to address them. It's never too late to make a change and start prioritizing our self-care, setting healthy boundaries, embracing personal growth, and taking responsibility for our actions. Remember, self-improvement is a lifelong journey, and it requires dedication, self-reflection, and a willingness to step out of our comfort zones. So, I encourage you to take a moment to reflect on your own life. Are any of these red flags resonating with you? Are there areas where you need to pay closer attention and take action? By addressing these red flags, you have the opportunity to create a more fulfilling, balanced, and authentic life. Thank you for joining me today as we explored these important red flags. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with others who may benefit from this valuable information.
And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to our channel for more insightful content on personal growth, self-improvement, and creating a life of purpose and fulfillment. Remember, you have the power to create positive change in your life. Embrace it, take action, and watch as you blossom into the best version of yourself. Until next time, take care and keep growing.